Hello everyone welcome to my channel please subscribe and stay tuned by clicking the bell icon. Inside Corey Simon Gregson's life from anxiety admission to Liam Gallagher feud. Coronation Street's Steve McDonald, played by Simon Gregson, has become an icon on the ITV soap since he first arrived on the cobbles in 1989. He has had turbulent relationships, owned the Rover's return, started a cab company, and recently helped daughter Amy Barlow, L. Mulvaney, after being raped by Aaron Sanford, James Craven. Outside of his time on the ITV soap, Simon also starred on I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here, alongside his Emmerdale and EastEnders co-stars. Simon recently opened up about the challenge he has faced over the last couple of years with his anxiety, which saw him take six months out of work. Express.co.uk has taken a look inside Simon Gregson's life from his recent mental health admission and his bizarre feud with Liam Gallagher. Steve first arrived in Weatherfield in 1989 after moving from army lodgings with his parents Jim McDonald, Charles Lawson, Liz McDonald, Beverly Callard, and twin brother Andy McDonald, Nicholas Cochrane. He started out as a family failure, impetuous, reckless, and a liar, and was always in trouble, doing a prison stint a year after moving to the cobbles for handling stolen goods. His first wife, Vicky Arden, Chloe Newsom, whom he'd marry for her money, left him when he tried to pin the blame on her. In 2000, Steve set up street cars with Vikram Desai, Chris Bisson, and the following year, he married Karen Phillips, Charan Jones, for a bet, but they fell in love. Their wedding was gate-crashed by Tracy Barlow, Kate Ford, who announced to the guests that Steve was her baby daughter Amy's father, conceived while Steve was separated from Karen. Karen married Steve regardless, and they tried to make their marriage work but her battles with Tracy eventually proved too much for Steve and he threw her out. After his divorce from Karen, he waged war against Tracy for access to Amy, but only gained custody when Tracy was sent to prison for murdering Charlie Stubbs, Bill Ward. In 2009, he gave up a stable life with Michelle Connor, Kim Marsh, to marry Becky Granger, Catherine Kelly, but their relationship was also wrecked by Tracy. Tracy finally got her wish and married Steve in 2012, but Steve dumped her at the reception, coming to his senses after Becky proved that Tracy had lied about her recent miscarriage being caused by Becky pushing her down the stairs. After a turbulent year of debt and divorce, Steve slept with Lean Battersby, Jane Danson, and both Michelle and Lean became pregnant with his children. Michelle lost their son Ruary in a late miscarriage, while Lean successfully gave birth to Oliver Battersby, Emmanuel, and Jeremiah Cheatham. When Steve confessed that he was Oliver's father to Michelle, she demanded a divorce from him. Following a reconciliation, Steve married Tracy and currently lives at 1 Coronation Street with Tracy, Ken Barlow, William Roach, and Amy. Recent years have seen him experience both heartbreak and joy as his son Oliver tragically died from a rare form of mitochondrial disease at age three, and he has met and bonded with Emma Brooker, Alexandra Mardell his daughter with ex-girlfriend Fiona Middleton, Angela Griffin. Simon starred in the 2021 series of I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here, when the series had to move from Australia to Bridge Castle in Wales. The Corey star placed second in the ITV reality series, with Emmerdale star Danny Miller being crowned king of the castle. Just days before the final, the pair faced a Christmas-themed challenge, Santa's Grotty Grotto, which saw them rummaging around in sacks of rotten vegetables and fermented eggnog before decorating a tree and drinking fish eye seven out of a possible eight stars for camp, winning partridge for dinner, but the star had to bow out of the trial the next day. Host Declan Donnelly said, Time for a very important challenge now and at stake was a chance to spend an evening at the Castle Inn, the castle's very own pub. Aunt Me Parkton continued, this one involved all the celebrities except for Simon, who was suffering from an upset stomach. Maybe it was something he ate at yesterday's trial. Deck quipped, I don't know. He sucks the juice out of a few fish eyes, spits it in a sherry glass, and downs it in one and the next thing you know he's not well. He's a delicate little flower, Simon Gregson. Aunt added as Deck said, give over. Despite being the lovable character on Coronation Street, Simon recently opened up about his battle with anxiety over the years. He shared the debilitating symptoms he suffered as he discussed his mental health struggle and discussed his recovery with ITV's Lorraine Kelly. He explained, 
It's an awful disorder. When it was at its worst, my little finger would go completely numb. My face would go numb. I get tunnel vision. You can't bring yourself out from yourself. You feel dizzy sick. Your heart feels like it's coming out of your chest. It's completely debilitating. It came to a head when I called my boss in the car and told him I couldn't get off the drive. I went to go and see the GP, and then ITV brought a doctor in. Lorraine interjected and said, Did they? I was going to say that about Corey, they are your second family and have been really supportive. He revealed, They have been brilliant. They got this amazing doctor in who works with the Royal Navy and the Royal Family, and he was lovely. He went, Six months off. This is crazy. It can happen to anyone in any walk of life. It's completely invisible. My goal is to talk about it and highlight it. Back in June 2021, former Oasis frontman Liam Gallagher revealed he clashed with Simon Gregson outside the Coronation Street Studios. The band were making their television debut at the time of the incident, with their hit song Take Me featuring on the soap. Liam previously told The Sun, The guy who is in Coronation Street, Steve McDonald, I was walking down the road with my jacket on, and he's come out, and he's staring at me, and I'm staring at him, and he's giving me looks back, and I've gone, what you f asterisk 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 looking at. And he's wound down his window and flipped the bird at me, and then I chased him down the road, and he wound his window up and drove off, and I kept catching him at lights. While Simon has pledged to have a pint with Liam, it doesn't seem as if he's been taken up on the offer yet. Soap actors often refer to their co-stars as their family, but it seems Simon's wife didn't get along with them all at one point. His wife, Emma Gleave, who he married in 2010 and shares their three sons, it out at Sally Ann Matthews, who plays Jenny Connor after she told a fan that autographs from the soap stars should be free. Simon sells video messages to fans online, and his wife quickly leaked to his defense on social media when Sally wrote in response to a fan, Write to us at Trafford Wharf Road. We do them for free. You should never pay for an autograph or a video message come to that. X? Sick. Emma responded. Wow. Nothing like sticking together with your work colleagues. Before adding in a tweet she later deleted. Grow a set of balls and tell her cast members her opinion. Sally didn't publicly respond to the message. If you like the video, don't forget to like, comment, and share.